transfer is. That number was never verified. Therefore, what happened in court was invalid. The suit also questions Judge Jennifer Medley's approval of the settlement after reports show Medley may have signed the recall petition herself. Mayor Cantrell's advisor Bill Roussel made it clear that they're not trying to impugn her integrity as a judge. But the fact that she did not ex uh, expose the fact that she had signed the recall and made the parties aware, uh, it just leaves a lot of questions unanswered as far as the fairness on this issue. So what's next? Well, a judge in Baton Rouge has two to ten days to schedule a hearing to determine if the strict recall statute has been followed. Baroussel feels the bigger picture is the disenfranchisement of black voters. There's a governor's race coming, and um, it's important for us to all be able to vote and to have the right to vote, and we should act as a unified city when we vote. It's about Mayor Cantrell, but it's about fundamental fairness for all citizens. Now, we reached out to the recall campaign organizers and their attorneys all day for comment, but haven't yet received one. For now, reporting live in New Orleans, Courtney Williams, WDSU News.